For many of us, our pets are members of our family. And tonight, a Clay County family wants the dogs that kill their beloved cats off the streets. And I want to warn you, some of the video you're about to see, you may find very disturbing. Uh, the video shows the dogs attacking one of the cats that they killed. And Brittany Dion is live tonight in Orange Park. And Brittany, I know you talked to one of the owners of the cats that was killed. Absolutely. I spoke with the owner of the cat, Thomas O'Malley, a little bit earlier today. She says that she is in shock that this all happened. And even worse, those dogs are still on the loose tonight. The video is disturbing. Two dogs can be seen entering a home on Gano Avenue in Orange Park and attacking a family's cat. The cat fights back. We'll stop the video here. It was hard to watch. It was really hard to watch. Bethany French wasn't home when her cat Thomas O'Malley was killed. Her home surveillance cameras captured the entire attack. Just attacked him for over two minutes. Came back several times and kept trying to get at him while he was already gone and then walked away nonchalantly like everything was okay. The family filed a report with Clay County Animal Care and Control. The report says the dogs live less than a mile away on Alsi Drive. I went by the home. No one came to the door. The dogs are accused of attacking not one, not two, but three neighborhood cats, killing two of them. Even worse, they're still on the loose. Thomas was a really great cat. He was a cat that was almost like a dog. He would walk up and down this block with us. He would walk to Whataburger and wait outside of Whataburger and wait till we got done eating and then come out and walk back home with us. French says she's frustrated with animal control, who told us they are actively searching for the dogs but have not made contact with the owner. In this email, Animal Control says once the dogs are found, they will be impounded and held for a dangerous dog investigation. In the meantime, French won't let her three-year-old play on the porch anymore, she says, until the dogs are found. Again, we've tried to reach out to the owners of the dogs. We have not been able to make contact with them. Another neighbor told me that she saw the owners out looking for those two dogs, but she says they have not found them just yet. If you happen to know where these dogs are or see these dogs, you're asked to give Clay County Animal Control a call. Reporting live in Orange Park tonight, I'm Brittany Dion, First Coast News.